to the Big Island, now a vehicle ended up again in the waters off Honokohau Harbor in Kailua Kona. This week's incident, the third time since 2023 that drivers have driven down the same boat ramp into the water. Hawaii Island Bureau Chief Jeremy Lee is at the ramp with more. It happened again for the third time in 15 months. A motorist drove their vehicle down this boat ramp and into Honokohau Harbor. But this time it was different. The driver was a local and responding to an order to move her vehicle, unlike the two previous instances, which involved tourists in rental cars. Similarly, though, the accident took place on a rainy evening, as it did in April of 2023, and then a month later in late May of 2023. Last Saturday, multiple witnesses say the Prius was actually parked at the top of the ramp and that the DLNR enforcement officer told the owner she had to move it and that the woman had an issue getting the car started. Eventually, she was able to and called out that the car was running. Then the car went down the ramp. Per one witness, quote, she was in the car. DLNR officers yelled for her to get out of the car and to swim to shore. Then they cuffed her and took her away. DLNR did not initially mention that the woman was cuffed, but later said it was, quote, for her own protection. There was no citation given. That she was given medical attention at Kona Community Hospital and described the events as, quote, a 33-year-old woman had her car parked on the boat ramp facing the water. She said her car wasn't working and then drove directly into the water. Local boatmen told Island News they were the ones that towed the Prius the next day as authorities could not get it out Saturday night due to the weather and the Prius not having a tow hitch. Island News reached out to the Department of Land and Natural Resources. We asked if there was any plan to improve signage here or even introduce illuminated signs. At this point, we have not had a response. Reporting from Kailua Kona, Jeremy Lee, Island News.